Hey, I'm KIC, and that is a lumber zombie about to be attacked by... Uh, we'll go with the bow. The bow works. Apparently, it's cold over here. Look at that arrow, man. That looks ginormous. And it is just uh, sticking right through that guy's head. Yikes. Okay, then. Have a seat, good sir. I don't know. That arrow just seemed really big to me for some reason. I feel like it's bigger than the other arrows. Whatever. We are running back over here where one of these days I will stop doing this because we'll make our own workbench so that we can make a motorcycle handlebars. It'll only take a minute. I feel like I should just vamp and kill a minute. So let's go look for a car outside instead. I mean, there's bound to be a car nearby, right? It's got to be one mini bike. Come on. Mini bike, mini bike. Wow, there are not any cars nearby. Well, we gotta go tackle a car anyway, so it's just as good a reason as any to, to go do this. And yes, I know, there are all sorts of dead bodies on the road that I should be, could be, whatever, chopping up for bones so that I can make more glue and not have to buy stuff. I totally know. I know, I know, I know, I know. It's just easier this way. Just saying. How you doing up there, birdie? I guess I'm going to try and keep an eye on you as much as I can. But this is kind of hard to do when I have no idea where you went. I guess I'll just go into stealth and we'll take care of that lumber zombie when he comes over. Be nice if we could get... Well, there we go. A battery. Got one. Perfect. I mean, it'd be nice if we could get an engine too or maybe even another battery. Hey! Don't do that. That's, that's a jerk move, buddy. I'm just going to put an arrow right through your face. I can't say for certain that this is the case, but if, it kind of seems like maybe the steel arrows break a little less than the iron arrows, which I would kind of see that as being the case, like just from a gameplay perspective. That kind of makes sense to me. Use the higher quality arrow, get more of them back, because it's a little more of an investment higher quality material, so it should have some sort of bonus to it. That would kind of work for me. I don't know that that's the case. It's just, that's kind of the impression I've had thus far. Wrong building. Let's keep going. All right. I think we're pretty much good. We're going to head back to base in just a moment. We're going to have ourselves a motorcycle. Going to have a whole fleet of vehicles before we're done. At least that's the plan. We're getting close to level 60. Level 60 is going to open up something. I don't remember what it opens up. It opens up something important. Of that, I am more or less somewhat semi-confident. I don't know. Whatever. Just mentioned that so you know where we're at. Let's keep on heading back to base. Should probably do a little building today. Although, I'm going to end up feeling like I want to hit the road once we get a vehicle set up. So, I don't know. We'll see how that goes. We're going to just have to head back to that place in a minute anyway. Maybe this is a good opportunity now to make a, a workbench. We can put the bed over on the other place and... Yeah, maybe we'll do that. What do we need for a workbench? Because I'm getting kind of tired of running over there. Forged iron, mechanical parts, wrench, claw hammer. All right, well, can we put the claw hammer... Hold on, let's, let's do this carefully. Let's put that and that away. We're going to grab that claw hammer, so we'll use the crappiest things we have. I think that wrench is the crappiest thing we have. I don't think that car battery is going to matter. I hope it won't, anyway. So here, we can make a workbench. It'll take two minutes to do that. I don't want to do that just yet, because we're going to need another wheel. So that'll only take 30 seconds, so let's do that first. We need a coal and a bottle of acid and some more plastics. So some coal, bottle of acid, and plastics. I think we should be able to make the wheel now. And then we'll go ahead and go back to the workbench. We'll queue that up while that stuff is working on. And then we can put... I'm glad I didn't end up making as many various things as I'd kind of planned on. I don't know, I'd kind of had a thought of making more uh, Molotovs. That's the word. Those are the things I'm looking for. Let's take this guy right here. We should have room for another mod on there. We'll add the Burning Shaft mod. And theoretically now, 
We have ourselves a nice flaming club. <laughs> oh, this is excellent. I like it. We'll have to light a zombie up later. That's going to be fun. I'm looking forward to that. Let's grab our motorcycle chassis. Let's grab our other wheel. Did we already grab that one wheel? Two wheels. Got a couple of wheels. I think we have everything we need here to put together a motorcycle. One bad motor scooter, so we're going to need an engine and a lead car battery. I don't think the quality of this stuff is going to matter. I really do don't know for certain, though. Whatever. I think we'll be fine. Where are we at with the workbench? We need another minute and a half on that. All right. Well, well, that is cooking, metaphorically. Let's go run over here. Oh, hi. We have a visitor at the new home. Oh, sir. Sir. We're not open for business just yet, if you don't mind. I'm going to... I'm just going to ignore you, because you're not going to respond. Don't really have anywhere in particular to put this, so I'm just going to drop it right there for right now. That looks good. Probably do something like, um... Ah, oh man, I kind of just want to put, like, some frames over here. Like, we'll just do something maybe along these lines, just to make a, a general fence. So we'll put that around all of the edges. And keep in mind, I still want to do this all, I think, with flagstone. I mean... Just to kind of use the materials, that's really all it's about right now. I mean, I suppose we could just go straight to concrete, but I already kind of put this flagstone archway in. And I guess we could always just upgrade it and it would be fine. Whatever. Here, I'm going to put these guys down right here, though. I'm going to commit to this for the time being. So we'll put this guy down here. And then that one, and we're going to go ahead and basically do the same thing right here. So we will replace this with the flagstone. Now remember, we can upgrade the flagstone to concrete. We can upgrade it to the reinforced flagstone, basically. Look at that. We are all done there. And this is kind of what I was talking about, what I want to do over here. So we need to go to the advanced rotation. And eventually we'll get there. Okay. Okay. Do that one, and then... Oh, this is painful. Oh, I should have... Should have taken that other one. Dang it. Because we need to put the spot in the back, too. Whatever. It's fine. That one. And then this guy right here. I'm trying not to click past it, because I don't want to have to play the game of clickety-clickety. I'm sure there's a faster way of doing this. Like, one of the various rotations will give me the one I want. I just don't know which it is. I mean, I guess I could try... On face? Yeah, I don't... Does that work? Does that maybe make it go... Ah, look at that. Yeah, see, I knew there was a way I could do it. That would be better. Perfect. And then maybe we'll just do... Something like... I kind of like the idea of doing this. Here, let's go and copy that rotation. I think that gives it a nicer look than if we're just kind of filling in with a bunch of straight up square faces. So that one would go right there and then this one would go right there. Okay, so that kind of gives you a little bit of a, uh, a front fascia. That's, that's kind of cool. I like that. I mean, like I said, it, it kind of has a little bit of a castle or fortressy feel to it, and if nothing else, it is the zombie apocalypse, okay? I'm not necessarily planning on doing a gigantic wall outside of the area with moats and spike pits and, I don't know, whatever sorts of various stuff you could do. I mean, I could easily be done. I mean, don't get me wrong, we, we could do that, but... It's not really in my plan. So what are we missing here? We need some electrical parts. If only we had electrical parts. We could make a motorcycle. Motors. Oh, never mind. I clicked on the wrong one. Well, do it then. It's only going to take a minute to assemble a motorcycle. Take that, Paul and Paul. 
We're going to put all these guys back. We'll use them another day. Look at that. We got a little extra ammo out of selling those guns, too. Not much. A little bit. We'll drop this stuff off. I'm going to start queuing up some more flagstone blocks just because we're going to need some more of them. So we'll do another 40 since that takes about a minute or so. Got some more cash. I don't remember. Did that drop somewhere? Did I... Oh, I didn't sell all of them at once. I only clicked once. I get it. I know what I did. I know what I did. Or what I didn't do. Maybe that'd be more appropriate, more apropos. I don't know. You ran out of fuel, so we'll let this keep going. We don't necessarily need all this stuff. We don't need this amount of, of steel, but we're going to want it at some point. So I figure, you know what? Why not? Let's just go ahead and get it cooking. What are we looking at right now for concrete? So we have 403 cement mix, 499 crushed sand. If we wanted to do another forge, that's going to require a bellows and a short iron pipe. What do we need for the bellows? How many of these guys do we need? I don't remember. It's been so long. Wood leather. Oh, we need nails. No kidding. Okay. Do we have any nails? Look at that. Perfect. Make a bellows. I'll go ahead and get that queued up because I'm going to want to do another forge when we're done. I'm ready to, to just transition to the point where we have a dedicated forge for cement mix, that sort of stuff, because I think that would be nice. Look at that. Got ourselves a level five motor scooter. Let's go put this thing down and take a look at it, and we'll come back and worry about the forge in just a moment. This is one bad motor scooter. <laughs> Holy crap. Oh, yeah. That is pretty cool. And this one apparently does not fall over. Make a liar out of me. Oh, my gosh. All right. We're ready to make the forge. Here, let's start a new forge. I think what we'll do is we'll just, uh, I don't know, we're just going to go on down the road a little bit. Where do we go? Oh, my gosh. Where do we go? Where do we go? I guess we can keep on heading south. There's still stuff there. I mean, there's still so much stuff in that whole area. I'm going to pick up the mini bike. Now, I don't have anything in its storage, obviously. Otherwise, I don't think you can pick it up if you have anything in there. I'm just going to say, let's drop this stuff off. Here we go. We'll drop all these guys off. Put the forge down there. I'm going to drop the flagstone off. I'm going to say we just do a little exploring today. We might not have a whole lot of time to do you know, like a, a big, like massive building or something, but I think we can have a good time just the same. I kind of want to... Well, that's all right. I'll do it that way. I'll put it in like a normal person. I don't think we're going to have to put anything in here because this one's just going to be for cement. I think we can drop those guys off. We'll just keep these. We don't really need anything else. Shouldn't need... Anything else? I'm going to keep the shotgun. We're going to go ahead and roll with the shotgun. We'll scrap that guy. 174 gas. That's probably sufficient for right now. A couple of splints. I do like carrying some splints around, some feathers. Here, we don't need the feathers. We're going to be fine on that for a while. Put that guy down there. And you know what? Let's just, uh, let's just go ahead and cruise down the road a little bit. I'm not sure what to expect for how fast this thing's going to be. I do know that it's going to be faster than standard, so your bike is not going to be as fast as mine. I think I need to grab something. What am I missing? I need a wrench. I do like to always have a wrench on hand, just because you never know. I might want to grab... I'm just looking here. I think the compound bow is going to be fine for a while. I'm going to grab some forged iron. That's... Man, that's the last of our forged iron. No kidding. All right. Well, here, before we run out, I want to have you cook up another 20 of that because I think we're going to need it. I think we're going to need it. Fill this guy up. I have a feeling it's going to need 200 fuel. Oh, wow. It's going to need more than that. Let me go grab some more. I already like the sound of it, though. So we'll grab that and um, one, two. That should be fine. I don't think we're going to need a full tank and, you know, there are always ways to get more gas, so it's not a big deal here. We'll refuel you. All right. We're going to head, I guess we're going to head south. So this is normal speed. 
Well, normal speed for me. This thing's moving. I like it. This is cool. I don't know if it handles any better. We'll find that out in a little bit. It definitely handles differently. I kind of want to test out the, the spikes on the front, see what they do. Pull up the map here. I think maybe what I'll do is I'll cut down this street. Uh, not this one. We'll cut down the next one. Because that's going to take us into some brand new territory. Which is silly because... I mean, go back and watch any other series I've done. I filled these towns out pretty quickly. Maybe it's just because it's still early days and we haven't really had... Full-on vehicles and all that sort of jazz. I meant to go down that street. We'll go down this one. It's fine. But, yeah. I mean... There's still a lot going on out here that, that I don't really know about. I don't know where... I don't know what's out here. I don't know what anything is. All that sort of stuff. That's unusual for me. It's really unusual. So we are now officially in new territory. It is hot out here. I'm just going to kind of cruise through a little bit. Hold on. Ooh, you even go in reverse pretty quickly. That's kind of cool. I wanted to check that bag. Alright, we'll take a candy cane club. That's fine. Blah, 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 blah. I like that. That's my favorite part. Otherwise, this thing's really quiet. I'm, I'm impressed with how quiet it is. Looks like it's mostly homes out here. There is something over here. We'll go check that out. I'm mouse driving right now. I probably shouldn't be. I should be on keyboard steering so that I can look around while I'm doing this. My bad. Excuse me. Coming through. What is this? Have I... Have I seen this before? Let's go check this out. Are you... I don't know, look at you. You're a regular gas barrel. You're a gas barrel. This is cool. I dig this. I, I like this. I'm telling you, these POIs are so good now. I mean, they were always pretty good. Some better than others. I mean, obviously, some better than others, but... Oh, did I bring the shovel? Okay, good. Ooh. Hi. Oh, I guess the dog is dead. My bad. I feel something coming on. The dog just stood there. I probably didn't give it enough time to fall over. Or it was stuck. And uh, I didn't get a chance to harvest it. All right, whatever. Just looking at the roof here. Is there anything up here? Doesn't look like it. All right, well, let's grab some concrete mix while we're here. And some more cobblestones, too. That's going to be nice. I mean, I'm a little more excited about the concrete mix than I am the cobblestones, but I'm not going to turn away a good, uh, a good little chunk of cobblestones, because clearly we're going to put them to use, even if all we're using them for... Ah, oh, crud, I didn't mean to do that. I did that out of order, and I knew that as soon as I hit the second time. I wasn't paying close enough attention. I was busy yammering away, being a yammerhead. That's all right. I was going to say, even if all we do is use the cobblestone as a means to upgrade to concrete, it's still worth it. How you doing, buddy? I'm looking to see what is going on here. Madam, you're a one-shot kill. I like that now. I think the bow could use another mod or two. That would be excellent if we could get another one. I mean, it is doing pretty outstanding damage, but... I was going to say, I'm looking around to see if there's an obvious path inside. I'm guessing it might be up top. Yeah, I do see a little bridge right there. I'd noticed there was kind of a hole in the roof when we ran in, but I didn't pay it that much attention, so... I want to trust... Oh, hi, guys. That this is a, an okay neighborhood. Oh, you're feral. And that no one's going to try and steal my motorcycle. I'm going to trust that's the case. You are not feral like your 
brother, cousin, neighbor, uncle, whatever was right there. Can I get any arrows off of you? Excellent. Well, I guess in that case, since they did the work, I'll just go ahead and go in through the front door. Oh, I was supposed to test this out, wasn't I? You're not on fire, buddy. Oh, now you are. Oh, that sucks for you. Yeah, take that. Look at you burn, buddy. Burn! That is excellent stuff right there. Smash. <laughs> oh, man. So many wonderful choices for a thumbnail. Do I do burning zombie? Do I do the motorcycle? Can I get the motorcycle and a burning zombie in one shot? I mean, decisions, decisions. Go ahead and scrap those guys. Garbage. I grab all of these chairs because, you know, wood. There's no one behind that picture. Got a suitcase behind that one. All right, look at that. That was a good little chunk of ammunition there. I'll take that gladly. Take some murky stuff. How are we doing with the sink? Sure. Check the trash bin. Oh, chrysanthemum seed. We still got to do some farming, man. Got to do some farming, man. Um, nope. Let's try and take that again. Thanks. You need to go away. No zombie coming up here. My bad. Oh, there's a wall safe behind there. It was nice that the medical supply has worked. I was able to actually harvest out of that. That was cool. I hadn't really been able to do that, I don't think. Uh, you look angry. Yeah, let's do it this way. Yeah, you're the angry one. Okay. Um, alright, well... If I have to repair it to pick it up, then I'll just... get rid of it. There's still someone around. Where are you guys? I hope I didn't miss... possibly looting... a medicine cabinet. Those are nice. Oh, my goodness. We'll take that stuff. Now, I need to remember here before we go... Bicycle chassis? Ah, sure. Whatever. Let me switch out my things here, my, my tools. Scrap those guys. I'm going to take this, and then I want to see what this breaks down into. Oh, holy cow. I think I need... Nope. I think I need the pickaxe for that one. I wanted to do that. Maybe? Yeah, I guess I do. All right. Well, I want to do this because I've been curious. I've been meaning to try and find out what you can get from one of these things. So, you know what? Let's find out. A little bit of metal and a little bit of experience. That is not worth it. The munition boxes... Now, those ones I know you can get some good stuff out of. So, I was just curious if that would turn out to be the same. Crap ton of experience for the bed. Gotta love it. We checked that. We did not. Papier. Your broken kind papier. So, I want to hit this guy and see what's in here. 28 swings later. All that for a crappy shotgun and three shells. Well, it's going to be 11 shells, really. I mean, because we'll end up dismantling, selling whatever the shotgun, and we'll get some ammunition out of it, so... It's all good. No complaints here. No complaints. I mean, it is a crappy shotgun. There's no question of that, right? It's just a statement. It's a statement of fact. It's not a judgment. It is a low-quality shotgun. I think we're done with this place, although... I do want to run back in here, because this is set up so that you can climb up this way. And look at that, there's a backpack up there I would have missed if I hadn't come in. I just wanted to jump up here to see if there's anything else going on. Anything on the roof. The roof. Anything aside from, holy crap. I'm out of stamina because I've been jumping like an idiot trying to climb up here. 
thought maybe there'd be like a bag or something. Because, yeah, see, this is what I figured, that this is the way you get in. I mean, I don't know that everyone's actually going to use that. That seems unlikely, but I, I don't know. I mean, what do I know? I'm just an idiot playing a game. Clearly, I don't know much about anything, but I do have a motorcycle that might be able to climb up this hill. Look at that. Sure did. Wow. I don't know why I did that, because I really need to go the other way, but... You know, sometimes you just do things to see if you can do it. And that's really all there is to it. I think on that note, I'm going to call it a day right here. I mean, there are still plenty of places we can check out. That was a pretty cool little, I don't know, like, car shop. Something going on there. That was enjoyable. I like that. So there's still plenty of things to do out and about in this area. I mean, not the least of which is we could maybe go a little further out of this area or explore this area further and see if there are any stores. So, I don't know. Maybe I'll just kind of do that. I'll, I'll start heading out this way and I'll join you on the next one. Maybe we'll start off with a little exploration and we'll see what we have out here. Looks like it's a lot of houses, but maybe there will be more. You never know. Guess we'll find out on the next one. So I'll catch you now. Until then, thanks for watching. See you later.